And I am Robert. And welcome to another episode of Two Guys Who Watch Movies. We are two guys, we watch movies, that's what we do. Uh, today's episode is going to be The Pit. The Pit? The Pit. Like that funny feeling I have in the pit of my stomach right now? Yes, that, that would actually be uh, quite... Uh, that, that works well with this movie, actually. Oh, uh, man. Uh, this is a movie that I actually... Yeah, hold off. Wait till it starts. Fine. You'll, you'll still need that, but wait till it starts. Uh, this movie is actually one I did not see uh, when I was younger. Most of the other ones that we've been doing so far, or we're going to be doing, uh, I've known about for a very long time. I actually found this movie like a couple of years ago. Uh, but the just the premise of it made me want to watch it. And after I've seen it, I've wanted nothing more than to subject someone else to it. So, that is what we're doing today. <laughs> okay, what makes me nervous is when you said subject someone else. The look you gave me, uh, might as well, you might as well have had battery cables in your hand and they asked me to take off my shirt because somebody's nipples getting shot during this movie. <laughs> He's like, subject. <laughs> no, 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 nothing like that. But you might feel a, a bit nauseous by the time we're done. <laughs> help! <laughs> there is no help. All right, we're gonna just gonna get right into it. This is the pit. And we literally start in the middle of the movie, which makes a whole lot of sense because I know what's going on, but Robert's got no clue what's going on. Uh, excuse me, I'm, I'm looking for a meeting. What kind of meeting? <laughs> oh yes, when I was a kid and just like to smack people with something. Who are you? I'm Jamie. Wait, what the f- I was wondering if I could join a club and- oh! <laughs> 3D punch in the face. I want to talk to you in private. I have something for you. Well, you know, it's good that oh, you're yeah? doing such a good job good. of editing this together in such a way that's comprehensible. You know, so there's also no credits or anything. Hey, nobody said bring the girl. Don't step on my pointed hat. Don't ask. Yep, just still smacking each other. Boy, what was the direction on there? Just smack each other until I say cut. Who eats a hot dog from both sides? <laughs> who who follows a kid who maniacally laughs as he's beckoning you forward? Come on. Yeah, I'm gonna believe some kid found a bunch of jewels and decided to just give it to some stranger who hit him. The girl said that like a stranger, actually a boy. <laughs> Get me! Such wonderful delivery. See? There it is. Just like I told you. You sure we didn't film this? <laughs> right there. Definitely certain we did not film this. No, I'm pretty sure we wouldn't put the kid behind a bush. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure I wouldn't come up with lines like these. Poke with stick. Poke with stick. <laughs> yep, he is doing the let's sneak up behind him. Bye, and push him. <laughs> the pit. Hey, guess what? This movie called is called the pit, and it has to do with a teddy bear. What if I told you I like it so far? <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
shouldn't be very scared. I kind of like it so far. I'm a little scared. I, I was in until the little girl talked. <laughs> oh yeah. She's a brilliant actress. Actually, I feel bad if it turns out that she actually didn't turn out to be, turn out to be a good actress. actress. Yeah. It's the old new 1984 Ford Hudson. That's right, folks. It's 1984 music for a movie where they have no idea what the tone really should be. <coughs> so we're just going to mix a little bit of everything in there. It's kind of lighthearted, kind of mysterious, Actually, and kind of family friendly. It might have been a little late with 84. This could be 70s. Uh, it's 1981, uh, okay. actually. Okay. So you're, you're close. Uh, at least that's when it was released. Don't talk. Right. But I Jamie, just do as you told If you're wondering what he's writing, it's I will not bring adult books to class. Oh. Which, right off the bat, gives us an idea of what kind of character Jamie is. Huh. Huh. Creative, Creative nude, nude photography. photography. I wonder if Jeffrey Dahmer started this way. It's one page. With hey, we're from Wisconsin. We don't mention Dahmer. Oh, right. No. Whatever him will like to start off this way. Better. I'll take your word for it. Presume Miss Livingstone will find some way to repair it. Yes, she'll find some way to repair a book that had a picture cut out of it. That's yeah, completely normal. Alright, Jamie. Rub it off and go home. Um, actually, I think that's the problem in the first place, is he wanted to rub it off. I feel like I've been watching, like, Andy Griffith. Oh, trust me, this is not that family friendly. The music just. Oh, yeah, but the music that. is giving such a wrong tone for this. Hello, Mary. It's Elton John, everyone. I'm returned. Thank you. No one's gonna notice a page missing. It's not like they actually read. It's true. Well, it's a picture book, man. There was pretty sure there was actually was there text. Was? I don't know. There were boobies. I lost. Oh, them. I'm sorry. Were, were you distracted? <laughs> there was boobies. I could be wrong. I wasn't paying complete attention, but I think there was text. Oh, and look who decided <laughs> to come by, that, Jamie. That's not gonna make the final cut either. <laughs> What is he doing to that wall? Oh, never mind. Oh. I think he likes you. I think she is not. <laughs> hey, you! Get down out of there! I wasn't doing anything wrong. Come on down! Just peeping on people? Right That's up. not wrong at all! It's so hard to tell when you're overdoing it. My husband, he tells me I'm too motherly. You know, always fussing about me. Does Jamie feel smothered? Oh, no, nothing bad. Only when I sit on him. It is a problem with some children. And being no, smothered. I don't mean to smother Jamie. When you sit on him. Yeah. Other children don't feel bothered by being smothered at all. No. They just get angry when you wake does up. Does this look familiar? Are you Freddy Phelps? Yeah? Who are you? I'm Jamie. I was wondering if I could join a club and... Boy, it's a good thing they showed us this five minutes ago. Otherwise, we would never have understood the context of this at all. They were getting their money out of that $5 worth of ketchup. He's... Well, he's going through that difficult stage. She farted. You know. Girls. Yes. It's also known as puberty. We can use the word puberty, can't we? Not 1981. Well, Apparently not. His mother, of course. It's a bike. I must have it. How dare you touch my bike? Ooh, don't mess with the redhead, son. I, I was just gonna. But I was just gonna. You ain't doing spit. Now, granted, he was grabbing uh, someone else's property. But boy, wow, that's a lot. She's gonna have him taken away for grabbing a bike. For touching a bike! For touching a bike. Yep. Cause too bad for you. If you don't mind, young man. Sorry. Well then move. Who is the The Benjamin boy. Oh, that one. Just not right that boy. 
Just not right, that boy. Well, he's addicted to toy cars. I realize it's normal for his age. Hello, dear. Darling, this is Sandra arriving. Pleased to meet you, Mr. Benjamin. How do you do? Is she a shrink? No. My wife tells me you have experience with problem children, Miss O'Reilly. No, it isn't that much of a problem. I am working towards my psychology degree. So I can work on a one-to-one -one basis with exceptional children. As it's very obvious, they're interviewing her to be a no, nanny. I don't love my son, Mr. Riley. I do. But I've never been able to understand an otherwise... And I say obvious because it isn't at all. Riley in his own head. We're part of this world, but... Wait, it's a frog. Please don't lick it. I see. And we had an It's a melted frog. With some old lady in the It's a bowl of frog ice cream? Seeing him... The hell am I looking at? Back, Just a frog, man. On. Except some Superman. Knew I should have taken acid. Playing cards. <laughs> the children at school seem to have picked this up and labeled him a nutcase. Face it, Andre. No, it isn't that bad. I think the wrong week to stop sniffing blue. <laughs> You're feeding him dirt? No wonder he's melting. One cricket. Gee, thanks, kid. Maybe he's hoping that the frogs will start attacking Jamie, each other. Time for food. to change for dinner. And my wife. Hell, I've heard of beer goggles, but this is a pretty little house, isn't it? Yes, it is. It's always good to make a first good first impression by holding up a glass and looking at everybody around the table. Dear God, please don't ever do that again. Ah, you did it again. Movie, don't do it again. Hmm, maybe I should be eating. It's had its effect on us. Well, how else am I supposed to look up your dress? I knew it. Yep. You know, I'm starting to think maybe he's a pervert. Movie. Hello, that young man. I was grabbing my knickers, the underwear, a uh, napkin. My collar's bigger than my suit. Bye. Bye, and you shall never see us again. Goodbye. Little did little Timmy know. <laughs> There were other ways to a cruise. A three day cruise. Boy, I'm glad we finally ditched that kid. Mm. This is good. It's apple juice. Why do you like it? Do you have a boyfriend? Yeah. Why? And a girlfriend. Uh, know what happened in school yesterday? No. Well, she what wasn't there. Yesterday? I had to write something on the board a hundred times. Oh, yeah? What was it? Not to... Oh, right. Maybe I shouldn't tell you that part. Mm -hmm. Not to crack my knuckles in class. Oddly enough, that's not what he had to write. Did you deserve well, it? Well, it didn't involve rubbing his knuckles. I never do. That one might make it. <laughs> you understand, Mrs. Lynn? She is stirring seductively while talking to a child. How old is your boyfriend? Uh, I don't know. I love the fact he asked her breasts that question. He did. Of her. <laughs> he did. <laughs> her. Well, oh, she's stirring off. I have work to do. I don't. I spend most of my time. I'll get it. It's a knife. I'll get it. You touched I said I'd get it. That's I hate it when people don't let me get knives. Well, women nowadays can do things for themselves. 
Why don't you go outside and do whatever you like? I'm gonna go talk to Teddy. Is Teddy a friend of yours? Well, is he? No, how about Espanol? Sort of. How do I describe an evil teddy bear? Hmm. Sort of a friend. Hmm. Why do you get so pissy over that knife? My gosh. She's not like the others, Teddy. She's pretty. Really pretty. And she wants to be nice. But she's got a boyfriend. Only. He isn't a real boyfriend. He's just a friend. That's all. Just a friend. Well, then, she's just what we've been waiting for, isn't she? Teddy talks. Yeah. Yes, Teddy does Maybe talk. She is. Aunt Margaret, I'm so I don't know. Is uh, exercising with your aunt crazy? A little bit. A little bit. <laughs> Maybe she isn't the best person to ask then. He's not normal. He's not normal. He, he, he likes girls. Good call. What is so abnormal about a boy who likes girls? They're all that way. She'll get So nice that Teddy is trying to help him out with his perversions. Teddy's a <laughs> Oh, please trip on escape. I'm fine. Hey, kid, I told you never to hug me there. Careful, careful. Nibbies! <laughs> that you can't show on YouTube. Mm. Is he staring at her nipple? Yep. <gasps> Jamie, what are you doing in here? What? I know where there's a huge hole in the ground. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Help out my mascot! <laughs> <laughs> I'm a preppy kid and you don't like it, damn it! Hey! Is he making horse sounds? No. But the music decided this is creepy. He's just running. I, I really think maybe they just got the scenes mixed up for the music? <laughs> This would make more sense for when he was leading the kid to his kids. death. Yeah, now, now he's just running. That's an oh, and, and don't worry, you'll know when that uh, scene comes in the film, because we'll have to watch it again. Oh. Isn't that wonderful? No. No, it isn't. It really isn't. It really isn't at all. This kid's running like eight feet. I'm fat and old and I can run longer <laughs> than that. <laughs> Do you remember me? I'm Jamie. Jamie. I'm the pervert. I like I'm girls. I'm the contrarian at home. I'm your friend. I was literally just here yesterday. Can you hear me? Hello. 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 Do you ignore your friends? Because that's rude. Somebody else knows about you. Mm -hmm. I wonder if the direction that they gave the actress was anything that happens, it's a big thing! Yeah, you make a big deal about it! Yeah. Oh, did someone get shot? Somebody just got shot! I'm pretty sure someone got shot. You know, I'm getting the impression that Jamie wasn't as impressed with that as she was. I don't know why. What the f? 
Because oh, they didn't they'll, see... they'll never see him there behind the pillar. Give me some sugar, maybe. Yes, because they figure that with the, the top up, you'll never be able to see them. No. My hat! Wait, stop. Could you talk about my mom? I need my hat! Yeah, you know he's a perv, lady. Put on pants. And maybe a bra. Squeaky, 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 squeaky. Jamie? Got a gun? <laughs> I've been waiting this whole movie to say that. <laughs> Did you really just ask the bear? Yes. Bye, Teddy. In four years, somebody's gonna t stick a tape recorder in your back and make millions. Watch where they got the idea from. Turn your head, do something. There you go. There you go. You know, I'm thinking maybe it's not in his head. I'm too, because usually in your head, things happen when you're in the room. Yes. It's difficult for them to happen when you're not in the room. I don't know how to tell you this, kid, but your pet snake and your pet frog are not going to be friends. <laughs> <laughs> Will you wash my back? Don't you think you're a little old for that? Hell no! covered up with suds. <laughs> Okay, so she said chocolate bars. I got you chocolate bars! Despite the fact she thinks you're a myth. Good morning, this is your wake-up call. Big old chocolate bars. I wish she would get me chocolate bars. I like chocolate bars that size. 1981 chocolate. I want you! No fun size crap here. Here, catch. Have the bag, you freaks. We got Mr. Good Bars, we got some Hershey, uh, Hershey Bars, whatever bars you want, we got it, man. Must be blood. <laughs> Must be fresh. <laughs> be Missy Mall. He's a new boy for one, and children always put new additions to the class through some sort of trial period. Oh, we didn't meet her already, that was it's the teacher. teacher? Yeah. teacher, okay. Doesn't play sports. He doesn't play sports. Oh my god, it's 1981. What is wrong with this kid? It's true, everybody plays sports. He's only interested in science. He's good at that. Did a wonderful project on Toad. He's interested in science? He doesn't play sports? <gasps> Nerd! His nostalgic critic would be proud. I can't wait to read my book. I can't even get home to read my book. I gotta read it now. How to draw. Nimra. Flesh Eaters? Well, I read the word Flesh Eaters in a book. Obviously, those things in the pit must be Flesh Eaters. Absolutely. Because they're read in a book. Mm. That is literally the title. Beef. It's what's for dinner. It's for my mother. Did your mother say what kind she wanted? You Something where you get a lot for your money. Oh, you mean stewing big with hamburger? Both. Well, it's sort of a mixture. Okay, yeah, because you mix hamburger and stewing beef all the, all the time. Oh, all the time. Did he not just give him a dollar? No, I think he gave him 20. Oh. A 20. You can get quite a bit of meat for a $20 bill in the 80s. And I think he did. Wow, those guys are making a lot of noise for their size. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure what animal in a zoo that they recorded for this, but I suspect it might be a couple. I can tell you which one it was. Which one was it? The wrong one. Ah. Uh, I think you might be right. How many freaking arms do you have? One, two, three, four. What? Oh. No, they're just lousy shadows. Just lousy shadows. Alfred Hitchcock would not be proud. So. As any smart child would do, when they want to make sure that they're not creeping out their babysitter, they sneak in while they're in the shower, take a marker, and write, I love you. Because that's not creepy at all. No. That really shows them that you care. Red Rob. Oh my god, I can see her naked. Is that booty? 
this Maybe booty. I shouldn't be seeing her naked. Before you go, will you leave me a picture of you? A photograph? Something naked? Please? Just leave me alone. Okay, please. What in the hell would make him think it was okay to ask that? Tell me he's not. What? No, he's stealing. He's just stealing. No. Nothing creepy, just stealing. Well, at least he left her some. Yeah, he was not going to take it all, but just a play. You know. Put the purse back. <laughs> Put the candle back. Oh, look, cameraman channel. <laughs> Talk to other children that way. That isn't a child, it's... Never mind. He's doing there from Miss O'Reilly. Fine, meat probably sits under his porch and eats it raw. You like the female version of Howdy Doody. Shut up! Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you <laughs> I love how he brought Teddy to feed them. That's that. No more. How much money do you have left? Enough for a candy bar? Two cents. Well, I'll think of something. You better tell Don't you look down the hole anymore? See if they're still down there? They're always there. They can't get out. Which is a good thing, isn't it? Yeah. What about Miss Livingston? That's his yeah. voice. Yes, you know. Oh, Miss Livingston. This is choir night, isn't it? Oh, I get it. Nudge, nudge, wink, wink, Miss Livingston. Oh, yeah, I know. You want to clue the rest of us in? Name Abigail? Yes. Is that the hat? You take Teddy? Apparently. And no one will ever find her. Oh, no. Anything. Just don't hurt her. What do you want me to do? First, take out the camel toe. Do you understand? Yes. I'm watching you now, Miss Livingston. You could call the police, but then, or Abigail. Yes, uh, he told her to undress. Do you know what is not on my bucket list? Mm. Seeing a librarian of any kind naked, even if she is kind of hot. <laughs> well, technically, she's an actress playing a librarian. I don't know if that might help say. No. Yeah. So I want to know how the recording knows so well what she's going to say back, because it is a recording. want to see my body. And I love the fact that he didn't accidentally talk while she was talking. Aunt Margaret, what are you doing? Was... Oh, it's just nude yoga. You know, it's the latest craze. Just undressing. I'm gonna kill you! Zul's in the movie. I keep, I keep waiting for the, the theme, that, theme to Mortal Kombat to bust out. Really? Yeah, with all the trees. Just how they keep filming around these streets. Well, yeah, but with the music, I keep expecting, you know... Them to kiss. <laughs> yeah, someone to kiss. It, it, it's, it's the old 60s smooch music, yeah. Yeah. Hi, would you like to take my flower? <laughs> Look, Cal. You don't know it, but... But somebody's gonna come and take you away and kill you. So I'm just gonna kill you now. Out of you. Yeah, why wait? Look, I've got some friends that eat meat too. And I gotta take care of them. You I'm gonna really take you don't. to see them. And I gotta get you to fall down the hole, or else they might starve or even get out. Even though he already said before, Ow. it's a good thing they can't get out. <laughs> um, actually, it's moving every time you tug.
So you just had to I keep tugging. Guess it's better this way. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I wasn't gonna feed you to a bunch of chuggle on. Girls, kill him! <laughs> He had one and let it go! <laughs> See, he can't pick up chicks at all. That one's definitely staying. <laughs> well, Teddy, you got any suggestions? I'm all out. That is one gullible child. Yes, and I think that's going to be one eaten by the troll child. I love the fact that he's... He can scare me, funny person. Ha! He told her it's a bicycle path that no one can drive. Well, she really is not very good at riding it. So he's not totally wrong. Da, 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 da. What'd he do? Well, he was supposedly had a cord there that caused the bike to stop. But there was no cord. Exactly. Apparently it was an invisible cord that uh -huh. caused the bike to stop. Did he steal her bike? He sold her bike. Yes, he did. And now they're chasing? Now they're chasing. That's right, because no one's going to see a giant hole in the ground, right in I front of them. I think so. Not now. And now he's got a bike and a whistle. Why were they playing whimsical music? Oh, that's very whimsical. A little girl died. Oh, I'm really not bad. The little girl died. Da -ha -ha. I really appreciate why were they playing musical music? Oh. I have my bike taken away. I'll be back soon. Oh, I understand the whimsical music here. Mm -hmm. This is semi-humorous. Especially when she's screaming. I, I, and he's having a hard time pushing her. And she could actually put her hands on the wheels and probably stop it. There is a small part of me that expects a person in green to ride by on a broomstick. Oh, believe me, we're going to throw you in a pit. We're going to get eaten alive. Nothing to worry about after that at all. How much does he think these things eat? Well, there's a bunch of them down there. There's like four of them, so... Goodbye. And even then, and now he's having fun with the wheelchair. This is a bad movie, Scott. <laughs> <laughs> Because it oh, torpedo, yeah, that's terrible. <sighs> you have no idea, but you have absolutely no idea. But the whimsical music should be keying you in that you're about to die. Wait a minute, no. be able to see a giant hole in the ground at all. Why are all these people completely missing the hole? I have no idea. 
It's pretty obvious. And they fall right in. There it goes. They have a football, a whistle, a bicycle, and a wheelchair. Yep. There's nobody else. Not that I can think of. There was only four nasty people that's in the whole town. Nasty. Well, that's oh, nasty. Oh, I think we can find two more, Jamie. Don't you? Two more? Oh, right, at the beginning of the movie. Right. I feel like I've seen this before. Oh, let's hit each other. Let's hit each other. Let's... Oh, yeah, I already made that joke. That was, that's one very bored pirate. He's just like, I don't even know what I'm here. I'm supposed to get killed off, I guess. But, you know, I just kind of walk around her a bit with this stupid ballerina. I don't know why you're here. I guess I'm a girlfriend. Or a little young stuff, but whatever. I was going to say, he's, she's like half his age. I know. It's kind of creepy. Who are you? But who are you? So he didn't remember him. It better be good. Come on. It ain't bad. Come on. <laughs> Why did the girl even go? Oh, no idea. I guess that's supposed to be her boyfriend despite the age difference. I'm assuming. You're a bad, bad, bad movie. And they couldn't even edit out the throwing and the eating and the hot dogs. That, that was so important. So important. Oh, I'm glad they kept the maniacal laughing, laughter in there. Didn't we already say that? No, I'm glad they kept it for the second showing in like the same thing. scene. Because they could have edited this. That's true. That's true. If this is some sort of trick, you little creep, you're dead. No, yeah, we're, we're not even going to fast forward this. We're not going to edit it at all. Back. We're going to have the entire scene all over again. We're hoping you forgot. Or just woke up. I and don't realize that it's padding. Which makes you wonder what he put in the bag. Despite the fact that he told him it's Jules, what did he put in there? Come on. And now he's like pretty much dragging the ballerina. So he will get me. I'm sorry, I stole the fun of it again. He kind of needs to be made fun of, actually. Yes, yeah, like every single time it's uttered. There it is. Just right next like to I the told. big hole. Wait, that let me. Nobody sees. No. Nobody Wait, sees the big it. hole. I'll get it. Yeah, you get it, and then I'll get you. How is it the blonde girl doesn't see him? I just dawned on me. She stays there, right? Well, as far as we are aware of, yes. Dun. 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 A two. Okay, she does see him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm like, lost or some junk? I feel like somebody's watching me. That's my name. Did Alan ever come over here and play football with you? No, he was where we were when the kid and then he dropped. No, I mean, no, no, he didn't. He didn't at all. So. See, you know, I'm telling the truth, I'm eating an apple. It's the truth eating apple. Do you know about? about what? About Alan. Alan never came over here and played and that's not normal. Yes, no one ever apology. skips football practice. Is that supposed to be my fault? <laughs> Jamie, I'm sorry. No, you're not. But you will be. <laughs> it's 
to us when we saw him. Maybe you're right, this kid can act. That was decent. Mm-hmm. Sure, but no rough stuff, Missy. Ah! And away we go! Three leaf, three leaf, three leaf, three leaf, four! Oh, damn it, that was three. Damn it, how am I gonna stop that leprechaun now? Oh, who brings our dog out here? Oh, I told you to clean up after him. Oh, these darn ankles. What? That's not me. They're pigs. They're pigs or warbots or something. They fell in or the ground collapsed or something. No. Let's go. No, they're trawl logs. I read about them in a book. They're from prehistoric times. Jamie, that's Oh my god, they got yellow eyes. And little tiny I mouths. I don't remember pigs having what? yellow eyes. That's his name. Yes. These things are even remotely like what you think they are. We can make money. Only no person has ever seen them except you and me. And this the bug is in my dress. Of thousands, hundreds of thousands of years old. We can make hundreds of thousands of dollars. Like They're one Harry. Not no, not these particular ones. Their race. There's their species. Why would they be running around? Jamie, honey, listen to me carefully. Yeah. There are special scientists called paleontologists and anthropologists. Well, I, I knew it had to be your imagination. Just and like Teddy. Right. Jamie? <laughs> Was I expecting that? Yeah, I was expecting that. I was expecting him to push her in, though, I'll be honest. Yeah, I was pretty sure. Well, oh, she's not already in. She's halfway she's, in. Well, no, uh, her dress is coming. There it goes. To kill them? Uh, not that long. Yeah. You know, I just dropped them in the pit, and I just heard a lot of screaming, and uh, that was it. That was about it. Was a man with a mustache. Oh, oh cars, come on, cars, looking for a man with a mustache. Uh oh, we're in trouble. In the early 80s. <laughs> oh, they better watch this dad. I mean, yellow. That's a creepy looking mustache right there. Maybe yellow or green. Maybe green. Maybe green. Maybe green. Maybe green. Maybe green. Wait, maybe if I give them multiple no, colors, it'll be more difficult for them to find them. Because they don't exist. Yeah, it was yellow. I'm too old for this sh Or green. It was definitely yellow. Or maybe green. Thanks for the help. But I know it was yellow. You can go to but bed it could have been green. Well, I always try to be helpful. We found a bike. Is this it? Yeah, that's a bike. Just sitting here like this. Strange place to park a bike. I'm afraid so, sir. I'm afraid it is strange. And sir, what? Bentley, you know why I chose to live in this town? Because they wouldn't take you anywhere else? Because nothing ever happens here. That's why. Help me, Obi-Wan. Help me. For a stroll, out for a stroll. We are just out for a stroll. Nothing bad happens when you're on a stroll. You can tell this is 1981. There's not 15 feet of fence around that rock. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Someone's <laughs> dropping meat in the middle of the forest again. She's butcher's gonna be really pissed about this. Damn Bigfoot. Sergeant. Yes, Got another missing person. No, this time he's not missing. He's dead. You know, he's missing some pieces. So yeah, he's missing his arms, his legs. Okay, sir, we got some corn here. Uh, we found some children in it. Um, we're a little creeped out. Somebody call Mr. King. We were following around a guy named Malachi. And a rose. Something about a rose. 
This is my rifle, this is my gun! I'm pretty sure this is what you do when you're looking for missing children and you're not looking to shoot large animals. It's, well, what if you're looking to shoot missing children? This is what it would look like. Large animal-like missing children? Sure, it's big butt, uh, foot, something. You chase me, cause boys are supposed to chase the girls. Nine, nine, definitely nine. We're the solid nine. Stay out of the corn, children. But Malachi said it's good to go in the corn. You really have a tackler yet? What's wrong with you, boy? You told me to chase her. The director said nothing about tackling. Besides, I hate football. We already discussed this. Oh, the director's been in the corn getting high for the last three scenes. It's a pit. Fed him a bunch today. And guess what? You're next! And that's the end! I'm not even kidding! That's how they ended it.